To deny the existence of ghosts is easy. Skeptics say, I'll believe it when I see it, and walk away. But the people we've met tonight can't just walk away from what they've experienced. Those who have had a paranormal experience remember it for the rest of their lives. But for some, the experience changes their lives forever. Driven by his own experience, Klaus Schreiber has become a leader in the field of paranormal video phenomena, PVP. At his home in Luxembourg, Schreiber points his video camera at the blank screen of a TV, which is on but not set to any channel. He sends the picture of that blank screen from his camera into the TV and begins videotaping. So he is essentially shooting a picture of a picture of a picture into infinity. Nothing appears on the screen while he's shooting, and nothing shows up on tape until he views it one frame at a time. What he discovers then are seemingly unexplainable images of human faces. It's already my calling coming. There she is on the right hand side. There she is. Hold her. The images are truly startling. But the most shocking one of all is a face that Schreiber is convinced is that of his deceased 17 year old daughter. He believes she is trying to communicate with him. There are as yet no explanations for the images Schreiber finds on the videotape. But others who have repeated the experiment have gotten similar results. PVP is one of the newest methods employed by those seeking a window into another world. And it's still extremely controversial within the field of paranormal research. But Klaus Schreiber isn't deterred by skeptics because his is a personal mission. He's not just trying to make contact with the afterlife. He's searching for one specific person he thinks he'll find there. For those like Klaus Schreiber, who believe that they've experienced the paranormal, a desire to understand what's happened is often felt on a deeply emotional level. Those who investigate the paranormal are driven by different needs. A scientific desire to find explanations to the seemingly unexplainable. And in the process, to perhaps find the answer to mankind's deepest question. Is there some form of life after death? I know we live in an age where people say, oh, it's all nonsense. Well, it's not all nonsense. There's something still left that needs explaining, which science at the moment doesn't seem to want to look at. I find it fascinating that we might be able to continue on after death. I find it fascinating that people might be able to move objects with their mind, that we can pick up information reported into the environment, potentially. To ignore it is to retreat into ignorance. To pursue it is to pursue one of the most baffling, enigmatic mysteries that we have ever confronted about the nature of our being. And in so doing, I think we have an opportunity to, to take a quantum leap in our understanding of ourselves, indeed, in our understanding of reality itself. The people who have been touched by the ghost experience wonder why it's happening to them. And investigators continue to search for answers. Their research and technology point to the fact that something is there. Just what that something is has yet to be determined. For Sightings, I'm Tim White. Good night. Next time on Sightings. Are they just the stuff that legends are made of? Or the world's most elusive and frightening creations? We knew right off the bat it had to be some kind of a monster in the lake. Monsters on the next Sightings. See why the summer of 92 may just be the hottest ever. As supermodel Cindy Crawford and in living colors Tommy Davidson hosts the Fox MTV Guide to Summer 92. Hi, I'm Cindy Crawford. And I'm Tommy Davidson. We'll take you behind the scenes of the summer's hottest movies. Hottest TV shows. And the hottest tours. Join us for the Fox MTV Guide to Summer 92. Sunday night on Fox. Now stay tuned for Hidden Video, next.